Welcome back, everybody. This is Lady Dubs, and we're picking up right where we left off. With the serenading violin that's now gone? Okay. Well, let's see what's on the desk here. Just a sad woman inside the house, it seems. Well, I get to keep that picture, it seems. Well, anything in Daddy's drawers? Drawers are weird to me. I, I have a Jersey accent, so I say draws. Last will and testament. I, blank, grasping at what remains of my sanity, declare this to be my last will and testament. I hereby deem all my previous wills just as worthless as the shallow husks calling themselves my friends and associates. To my agent Thomas Caldwell, I bestowed the hellish vermin that infested my home, praying that they will gnaw away at him endlessly, bleeding him dry, just like he did to me. To my publisher, Liam Brickstone, I bequeath the flames that consumed the love of my life, in the hopes that they will devour him, along with the wretched whore and the squealing bastard he calls his family. To my lawyer, James Jerome Sadler, I pass on whatever illness has rotted my mind and soul away, so that he can feel just as empty and useless as he was to me. And to any other parasites that come crawling out of the woodwork, I leave nothing. To hell with you all. Finally, to my beloved daughter, Blank, I leave all my earthly possessions for what they're worth. I hope that they will inspire you to realize your true potential, the final, most precious gift. However, it is not mine to give. You'll have to discover it on your own. I believe in you. I always have. I mean, if I remember right, those people were trying to help you get your daughter back and get you jobs, but you were just a jerk to everyone. Ah, can't open the thing because the freaking chair's in the way. Whatever. Uh, okay, can't, can't walk out that way. Well, at least I have a flashlight. Jeez. Well, out of the office. Did I see this before? Oh, yeah. That's just the lies, 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 rats. Well, why don't we go into our room? Oh, wait, this was the room that had the painting in it. Oh, it's gone. They're all now just paintings of the same woman with different hairstyles. Hello? Oh, here's something. Oh, he's going crazy redrawing the same woman over and over again. Yeah. Oh, here's the one that, uh, had the paralysis of the face, it seems. Anything, like, can I interact with any of these? No, it doesn't seem so. Well, I guess she was trying- he was trying to recreate his masterpiece. Oh, my room. It's all empty now. I mean, that's for the better. I don't live here anymore. Oh, God. All right, young lady. Shall we continue? I don't want to. Whatever happens, just keep looking at me and listen. Okay. Now, where was I? It's fine. I'm just the gonna Jesus look at him. Was all alone in the dark. And yet, she felt that the evil witch was lurking nearby. As her eyes adjusted to the darkness, <laughs> she saw something moving. <sighs> I'm still looking at you, Dad. As her eyes adjusted to the darkness. She saw something moving in the corner of the room. And yet, she did not dare to move. For she knew that that would be the end of her. <gasps> oh, what? Hello? What? I didn't mean to if she turned around like. Stop it, stop it! No, no, no! Monsters. Jeez! Ears wearing even the slightest sound. Princess from the oceans, letting the monster pass. Okay, good. It seemed like the worst was behind her. It was not over. 
Oh, come on. Your story stink dead. Okay. She heard a terrifying cat. It's fine. No, no, no. It's not that he was cruel. It's just that, to him, reality was just a pale reflection of art. He was blind to the world, unless it was translated to him through a canvas. So he freaking told me that story while he was trying to paint a picture of me? I guess that was the photo. Oh, now she's feeding her dollies to the doggy? I mean, that just seems like standard rebellious behavior from a little girl. What? Oh, that's just boards. Well, you know, that wasn't nearly as long as the other nightmare that we went through. Alright, let's go, uh, into the nightmare that would be Mommy and Daddy's room. God, I hate this. I'm saving the painter's room for last, by the way, if that's what you guys are thinking. Oh, this this might have been Mama's room. Let's let's start with this door and work our way down. Okay. Well, here's another picture. You're in the closet. Daddy's yelling and Mommy's crying. What happened? I remember there was another armoire there. Full of bottles that scared oh, the crap out of me. I don't remember that being there. I can hear you out there. Please, please help me. It hurts. Oh, it hurts so much. I can't take it anymore. Oh man, she must have been an ag- Why won't you help me? Oh, you're just like your father. You don't care about me. You probably wish I was dead. I don't wish that. I was just going through this, going to this thing. All right, I need a, a disc for you to work. I do care about you, Mama. Come on, I understand that what you're going through. Like, I can't resent her for that. She probably was in genuinely a lot of pain. Oh, the poor woman. Yeah, I don't feel any resentment towards her. She took her own life, yes, but she was suffering too. Physically and emotionally. <sighs> I feel bad for her as well. No, nothing changed in the closet. Well, I winded this thing up, but I don't have a record for it. And I don't see a record anywhere. Well... I guess we'll just move on to the next room. Oh boy, here we go. Oh, thank God it's locked. Okay, just another quick look-see in here. Like, I remember when, like, uh, I was struggling to find that, um, kitty wheel, and then I found it after, like, being a little bit more aggressive in my search. Maybe I can find a disc to put in there, or a key. 
Maybe. Uh, I mean, that could just be wishful thinking on my part. Mm, probably just wishful thinking. Yeah, there really isn't much of anything in here. Nope. Nope. Is that a foot? Oh! It's Daddy's prosthetic leg. Looks like it's got bite marks in it. Why is Daddy's prosthetic leg in here? Oh, wait a second. Something in here? No? Nah. Well, I found something in that room at least. Wasn't really what I wanted, but it was something. Maybe now that I interacted with the prosthetic leg, maybe I can now go into this room. Nope! Fine by me! Alright, well, I uh, guess we'll examine the downstairs. I guess. Got nothing else to do. Oh boy, we gotta go into the painter's room now. Okay, deep breaths. You just know that this room's gonna be the worst. Here we go. I wonder when was the last time this place saw sunlight. Never. Our rat pictures are gone. That's disappointing. Uh, anything in here? But, oh, it looks at this picture here. Hi! Blankness. Crayon or paint? I'm a little girl, I think again, so I'm gonna do crayon. What are you doing? Put what? that down! You're much too old for that childish nonsense. What do you mean? It's totally fine to draw a little happy pink horse. Also, what drugs did you slip me? What the hell? Oh, a paintbrush is there. Oh. What does this do? Oh! This is nice. La 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 la. Walking down the street. Yeah, Dad, I'll work on your painting later. Right now, I'm gonna go on a nice, peaceful walk in the Forbidden Forest. Oh, danger! Well, let me out. Creativity is not a toy! It's a gift! Do you want to squander it like all those careless brats out there? I, I don't know what your deal is, Dad. You can make perfectly good art with crayons. Oh, it is dark. It is very dark. Uh... Oh, I guess I can't really go far into the forest. Or I'm just lost in the forest. I'm probably lost. Probably was not a good idea to walk out here. Oh, pretty flower lights. Okay. That's fine by me. Oh no, we're back to the... The route. Okay. So let's not go back there. I think we got what we needed. Okay. Oh! Well, that just makes me sad. I know I can touch the paintbrush, but I want to keep exploring this world. It's like a world of childish drawings, which are very pretty. Alright, follow the sign here. Follow the chairs. And click here. Puppet show! Uh, hello? Good. The little girl in red was walking through the woods. Little when Riding suddenly, Hood. out of nowhere, jumped out you know who. Eyes glowing bloody red, teeth sharp as razors. And yet the big bad wolf did not seem to phase her. Be careful, little girl, the big bad wolf sneered. You're in fantasy land, where things ain't what they seem. Oh, shush, you big old meanie, the frightened girl exclaimed. You're the only threat in this wonderful land. With my magic crayons, I can do no harm. I can make the trees yellow, turn them upside down, turn grass into candy, make the sky go red. I can do whatever pops into my head. 
The wolf was unimpressed with his show of skill. You do have the power to do what you will. Alas, I humbly urge you to practice restraint, for you are responsible for what you create. You're nasty, jealous, and mean, said the little girl. I just want to have fun, and you want me to learn. I wish a big old rock would fall down from the sky and crush your big bad mouth into a mincemeat pie. Don't do it, I beg you, the big wolf cried. You lack scale and perspective, my sweet little child. But it was too late. His warning fell on deaf ears. Down came the rock and smashed them all to smithereens. That story sucked. Oh, there's the giant rock. Can I get a refund? The story was terrible. Can I go, like, through it? Nah. Let's see, is there, like, a crayon around here? I wonder what watching that accomplished. Ooh, more back here. Oh, wait, no, it's just the same. Well, I have a crayon. Let's keep doing crayon. I warned you time and time again! I won't let you waste time in these mindless doodles! This is for your own good! No, Dad. I get to do what I want to do in Fantasyland. Let's see. What do you do? Ah, gotta pull you out like Exc Excalibur? Nah. Can't. Can't seem to do that. Not strong enough. Gotta say, this fantasy world I kind of like more than the haunting world of our house. Starting to second guess that. <laughs> what the hell? Okay, don't go that way, apparently. Okay, follow the little footprints. Yeah, okay, footprints are gone. Uh, right or left? Well, the right has a unicorn, so... Duh. Oh, a little footprint still. Let's keep following the footprints. Oh, unicorns. Little treehouse. Apples. I don't see anything to interact with. Uh, can I climb? I can, but I can't interact with anything. This is really cute, though. Oh, don't go that way. Okay, I will respect the sign, and I will not go that way. Oh! I could open that. What? Where am I? I'm just looking around. Okay! Well, oh, oh, oh! What's going on? Dollies, what are, what's happening? Big bad wolf coming along? What? What's that? Huh? It's moving. Oh! It's a nutcracker. Oh! Oh great, the ladder fell. Oh. He did that. You're a jerk. Oh, you're trying to chop down the tree? Hey, you jerk, don't you do that! Trying to annoy me? This is not what I've taught you. I'm probably gonna get a bad ending if I continue down this path, but I'm already committed to doing all crayons, so... Come on, guys. We're gonna do all crayons. We're gonna make Dad mad. We're fine. We're following the path. 
following the path. Nothing can get us. Oh, God. Let's change that to something more happy. What? You think I'm enjoying this? You think I'm doing this out of spite? Get it right next time and I won't have to fix it for you. You call what you just did fixing? You made it into a nightmare, Dad. Well, is there anything that I can interact with nearby? I'm not touching you, paintbrush. Well, this seems to be a path. Let's follow it. Why must there be rattling? Okay. Don't go that way. Fair enough. Let's go this way. Okay, you're running that way, sweet pea. But that has an X on it. I'm gonna follow the rules and not go that way. Oh, it's a good thing I didn't, because there was a snake. Hello. You look interactable. Let's charge you up. Jack in the box. Na -na -na -na. Aha! You didn't get me that time. I saw that coming. You're doing this on purpose, aren't you? Yes, I am. Okay, now let's follow the path back home. If you hear hissing, please let me know. Oh, it's just rain. Oh, okay. We're nearly back at our drawing. Oh, come, you call this improvement? It's terrible. There, I hope you're satisfied with yourself. Stop crying. We'll pick this up tomorrow, and I swear to God, I better start seeing some progress. Looking back, I don't think my father ever really wanted a child. <laughs> it's no wonder I was never truly allowed to be one. No, no, what he wanted, above all things, was a successor. Someone to carry on his legacy. Anything else was just a distraction. Nope, nope. What happened? Guess I can go into that room right now. What's this Why pink? Because I'm a little girl. Painting lessons. And wipe this. Oh! Oh! Oh, I can put them in an order, it seems. But I don't know which order is right. Okay, uh... Let's see, there's Mommy's room. There's the painting room, the door upstairs, there's my room, the painting room up there, so that would go there. The kitchen, maybe it's here, and mommy's room would be there. I, I just don't know. My room would be there, maybe? I, I don't know. I need some sort of clue to help me find out which order this, this stuff goes in. Nope, nothing in there. And eh, nothing in there. Surprise, surprise. Needed a blank and plastic tubing. Oh. I looked for... Yeah, this is like where he had his ingredients. Screw you, Dad. What's in here? Red paint. Please tell me it was paint. Uh, fluorescent paint, Surfrino. Okay, so looks to be legitimate paint. That isn't bad. I guess now I can go inside uh the upstairs room. May as well just keep the video rolling. I don't know. Feel no need to stop recording since I feel like this might be the end. I don't want to like make too short of a video. Okay. Uh, swallow 
scared. No. Not gonna find what I need in there. Let's see. Do you open now? You do. So, after all this time, after all I've been through... Stay here. Your mother and I need to talk. This is all you have for me? And of all places, you chose this room. You think I don't hear that? Stop crying! Don't make me come in there! So many memories. This... this one room filled with more memories than I can count. I thought I told you to be quiet! Oh, the lovely memories. I imagined him standing there, all smug and pleased with himself, thinking this piece of canvas was somehow going to fix everything. I imagined what I would say to him, what I would do. My daddy, you shouldn't have. You really shouldn't. Uh, darling? Darling, I think you should move. I think you just started a fire! Get out of the house. Get out of the house. Oh, no. Get out of the house. Um. Okay, so that's the ending I got. Please tell me there are alternate endings in which I don't die in a house fire. That would be very much appreciated. Oh boy! This game is something alright. Ah, uh, something that's definitely gonna give me nightmares later on. But I think with that I, I can finish the Layers of Fear series. If people want to watch me play it again and see if I can get another ending, I, of course I'd be more than willing to do that. Because I'm curious too. But... As long as no one really wants to see that, I may as well just move on to another game. But, wow, this poor little girl. Well, now she's an adult. Her mom is in a horrible accident, commits suicide, her dad goes insane, is abusive towards her. It's her dog, too. Alright, well, let's just foresee what it looks like at the end of the credits. Maybe we'll see a little extra scene. See you guys then, I guess. Alright, I guess that was the end of it. Well. Oh boy. This was some series, I gotta say. I think my next one is, uh, not gonna be a horror game. I think I played enough of those for now. I need some, I need a breather. Oh boy. Alright, well. Thank you all so much for watching. If you enjoyed the video, hit subscribe. If you want to stay up to date on any future stories, ring that bell, creepy singing. And as always, thank you so much for watching. Later!